Victor Soy. Oh. Sved Svedza Po Imeni Sol Solnuts. Speaking Russian today. <laughs> If it's one of many stars, there could be, you know, like the the center of your life is not the center of somebody else's life. I don't know what the song is about right now. You don't? No. How are you gonna ask me what the song is about? You don't know not, what the I'm song not, is about. What's going on? It's Memberland Podcast, Struggle the Preacher, Jewels. Jewels. And we are ready to listen to another song. Let's go. It's gonna be like an in instrument. Like a little maraca. Yeah. Victor Soy. Oh. Um, Sved Svedza Po Imeni Sol Sol Nuts. I don't know. I don't know how to say it. So, so. You don't have to be right. I don't know. I said it. All right, let's play it. <laughs> <laughs> say it one more time. Uh, the whole thing? We can do it if you. Fezda po emeni sol sol nuns. Okay, you, you can all right. do it all right. <laughs> all right, yeah, how do you say it? Sonse. Sonse. Oh, see, now that makes more sense. You want to try again? Sonse. Sonse. I'm speaking Russian today. This one's not as easy as the last one. What, what do you mean, not easy? Like, I'm trying to, you know, I'm trying to pinpoint something in the song to give me, like, an idea of what he's talking about. There's, it's, it's no inflection of, you know, like, it's kind of the same. So I can't be like, is he excited about something? Or is he just talking about life? Or, and then now I'm trying to think of what are the different classifications of topics music talks about? Like now I'm trying to say like, what are the different things that music talk about? So I can figure out what he's talking about. <laughs> I feel like if I knew one word, it probably would help me out. Are you talking about his life? I would say life in general. Mm. It's like more... Like a trial and tribulation? Yeah, like a philosophy. You know? So the word that you asked me that you could not read is the sun. Mm. Oh, okay. It means the sun. The sun, yeah. the The, the title is um, the star named the sun. Mm. 
and so he's basically like you know about the sun but it's not about the sun as a planet it's about i'm, I'm trying to listen to it right maybe now maybe well, the star uh, named the sun well because well if you look at it like in our life the sun is just like our there are many more stars in the galaxies and everything else but the sun is our primary source of like life mm-hmm. so but there are many it's only one of many stars so um maybe like in a philo- philosophical sense like if it's one of many stars there could be you know like the the center of your life is not the center of somebody else's life I guess I don't know. I don't know where I'm well, going. You know, just like because I'm so confused, I don't know what the song is about right now. You don't? No, I just like. Uh, well, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta say that. <laughs> Are that you gonna this, ask me what the song is about? You don't I'm know not, what the I'm song. Not, is. I'm not asking you what. I just ask what you think it is about. <laughs> but sometimes, you know, just like I said many times, you can make out words, you understand every word mm-hmm. that you hear, but you cannot put it together what he's talking about. Mm. You know what I'm saying? It's just like you have to. Like it's some some philosophy in it. And when I ask you what the song is about, I just wanna I wanna hear what kind of oh, vibes you vibes. have. For, yeah, yeah, you from this song. It's not like what exactly it is about. And right because I never listened to this when I was a kid. The song is from the late '80s, and mm-hmm. the, the, this this guy he's like a legendary singer, and he was killed like late '80s, and he's like a, become a, you know like Tupac, Elvis Presley know like a legendary a figure yeah yeah so he has that status and i never listened to that song I, of course I, I always knew about this song but i didn't really pay attention to the lyrics right now when i, I did when i i play this i i also just like I, I again i understand every word but i just like i, I don't try to You're put it to together, it together. like in, into the meaning what he's talking about and i'm just trying to let me let me uh i think he's talking about something about the war basically because they they uh, people die all the time. The the the, the earth becomes red. You know, like uh, I, and I'm trying to now realize how he puts the sun in, into. It's what sun, what the sun has to do with it. Yeah, so he's saying it's like they this uh so he's talking about some city that is two thousand years old, overcast with the uh, clouds, you know, so the sun doesn't really come through. And he it says it's two two thousand two thousand years old and stood under the sun for the for this long. So I, I think he's talking about, you know, some kind of like a uh, tragic events happening on earth pretty yeah. much you know about wars in general that you know took place over the history so i think yeah i'm sorry you know like i, I want to say sorry to all the russian fans who love this this song and i know that song this song means a lot to many people in russia so i'm pretty much i want to say i want to apologize for you know if i if i interpret it in a wrong way so you can always correct me and write what this song is actually about so I will appreciate any kind of input that you guys have on on this song because I'm not a fan basically of this band and I've never been a fan of this. You know, uh, I just I like the song like it's a, it's a good song so far, but uh, I don't know much about it. Just like I never paid that much of attention to the song. You know, what I'm saying. So, okay. so how did you pick the songs that you put in the cup? Uh, well, I know these songs, of course. I mean, and like I said, I listen to most of them. You know, and. But listening not always it doesn't always mean that you actually listen, listen, listen. to what whatever yeah. meaning he he's trying to deliver you know mm-hmm. come thinking kind of do you just like pick the songs or like I mean I don't know I just wanted to know how you pick the songs I pick the songs up. basically at least so something to my liking you know one way or another that way you I, don't have to sit there and listen to something that you don't like no just like again uh, uh 
My friend, uh, well, he commented on my last episode that I dropped. He was like, oh, I felt, I felt like if I was in America right now because I never heard this song before. I was like, yeah, that's the point. I mean, it's like it's not only American people get to learn some new music, you know. It's all, also Russian people who don't know a lot of good Russian music, you know. So I'm pretty much trying to preserve, if I can say this way, you know. I can preserve and kind of s- spread across across the, I don't know, I don't want to say the globe, but across nations at least, some, some, some what some I think good, good music good. to my... In, in my opinion, good music, you know, I, I, like I always say, tastes differ, of course. And it's not necessarily that even you, my guest, got to like it, something that I play. And it's okay if you say I like, like the it. first one. First I, one was... I don't feel it, like, you know. And the first one, yeah, was cool. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>